A local beauty supply store owner says she's on the verge of losing her business that she says fills an important big need here in the Coachella Valley. News Channel 3's Miyoshi Price live in studio after talking with the owner of McNeely's Beauty Supply. Miyoshi, you discovered that there's a lack of hair care products for people of color here in the Coachella Valley. Hi, Jan John. Excuse me. Yeah, this is something that I have experienced since moving to the Coachella Valley. I've struggled to find the hair care products that I need to keep my kinky curly hair moisturized in our dry desert weather. I spoke to people with the same concern at a shop that is on the brink of closing in La Quinta. McNeely's Beauty Supply has seen less and less foot traffic. Victoria McNeely opened this store three years ago with the hopes of providing hard to find hair products for people of color. I have to go through vendors all over the world to provide for everyone. The products on the shelves are predominantly for textured hair. When your hair strands create shapes like curves, spirals, curly or waves, you have textured hair and you need a special kind of product. I feel like this is one of the good spots to find like products and stuff. I barely see like hair shops like this in the Valley. While McNeely's struggling to make a profit, she believes the market is here in the Valley. The Coachella Valley is filled with the Mexican community all over the place. I'm a Mexican myself and then with someone who has textured hair and I'm, the Hispanics is diverse. In hopes to find more customers like Arleth Mejia, it has everything like hairs, wigs, like baby hair combs, like it has everything, like everything you need, like to style your hair, to style anything, like they have everything you need. So if you got to come, come, come. <laughs> to appeal to more people, McNeely had to think outside the box, bringing Detroit based hairstylist Akia Johnson to the valley. It just makes me happy when I do someone's hair and they're satisfied when they walk out. They, they have a different walk to them, you know, a different confidence. And Mejia says she feels that happiness being able to find what keeps her hair flourishing. I barely started to learn how to love my curly hair, literally, and I like it a lot. Like, people with curly hair should embrace that a lot. And I tell my little sister, too. My biggest goal is to help the community, provide for them, um, make them look beautiful. I learned about McNeely's store while getting my hair done. She is still hoping to be able to sustain her business in the coming months. Live in studio, Miyoshi Price, News Channel 3.